probably straight to the way to the men's. Oh, over here. Shoes. <laughs> oh my god. Shit. Yo, Ryan, I found them. Here we go. Perfect. Ultra stylish. I'm just gonna go with the black. Black it is. Okay. I don't know. Oh shit. Oh! Oh! Bingo. Look All at right, that. Damn it. Time to fucking bring those. <laughs> Ten dollar more ones, <laughs> but you'll have them forever yeah, for our further yeah, expeditions. These yeah, can be see, your explore these boots. These are so much better, dude. Okay. Yeah, these are my TN Explore boots. Is what these are. If you're not on the TN Explore channel right now, go over there and subscribe to Wes's new channel because it's going to be rad and a lot of fun to watch. The green galoshes. Okay. Yeah, that's not a terrible idea. Perfect. Perfect. Hey, Tom. It's all right. All right. So we're in this crazy gas station in the middle of nowhere, and uh, they sell shoes, like high heels. Sexy shoes. What's up guys? Today Wes and I are doing some actual exploration. We've never really done anything like this on the channel, but it is car related, so we've got a lot of cool stuff to show you. We're actually hiking in right now to an undisclosed location here in Nashville. If it is your first time on the channel, go down there, hit that subscribe button, turn on the notifications bell, and like the video, guys. You got a lot to see. So basically what's going on here is we have a very secret location that we're gonna go check out. There's supposed to be a bunch of old engines, a bunch of cars, and all this stuff has just been abandoned. So we're gonna go and see what we can find, and see what we can show you guys. Well, the door's not locked or anything, so it looks like we can go on in. Yeah, we're, we're walking up here. This so just, the road like ends here. Blast. Doors are yeah. open, so gates open. Okay. Uh, we're gonna look around. Like a... So if y'all wanna go left or right, it's up to you. The engine house is over here. I can't believe all this shit's just sitting here. There's uh, spikes on this. Gotcha. Kind. Big ones. Alright guys, be careful. There's lots Holy of fucking thorny, thorny bullshit over here. Though. Guys, we have to go through this van to get to the rest of the junkyard. <laughs> hey, you're snagged, Ryan. Okay, you're good. <laughs> Who blazed this trail anyway? <laughs> Who found this? The first time. Did you find this trail the first time? No, we uh, we kind of blazed the trail. Oh, I and see. We realized that all of this like was Ford blockage. There's a lot of things that are strategically placed. Wow. Oh man. Um, okay. Look at that, guys. It smells wow. like transmission fluid in there, straight up. Yeah. Wow. This is just the appetizer. You That's guys want amazing. To go for it. I don't really want to get in there. I don't know about the deck of the trip. This is crazy. <laughs> this is absolutely insane. because the ceiling's all caving in, but I bet you could find some stuff in. Is that a throttle body over there on that shelf? Um, yes. <laughs> a fan shroud, a headlight. You never know. All right, boys. Oh, here right, it comes. Ready. Here it comes, guys. This is what we came for. This is what we came for. Fucking farted real loud. <laughs> 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 
That's fucking going in, man. Guys, we have stumbled upon the automotive barn find mecca with this place. If you haven't yet, go down there and like this for me. More engines. Basically what we're just now gathering is that it's been a long, long time since somebody's been here. At least 10 years. Because you've got trees blocking the doors from closing on vehicles and stuff. So that's been there so long to grow up in front of the door. It's crazy. This place is amazing. If you haven't yet, go down there and leave us a comment about what you think about this place. This forerunner right here has definitely seen better days. This stuff's here. It's, yeah. This stuff lives here now. Does it have a LS engine? No engine, completely and utterly sandwiched. It's been split and twined. How far off does it go, man? Yes. I, yes? <laughs> you haven't, you don't know? No, it goes all the way back until the valley meets together. What? Really? Yeah, I mean, you've got another quarter mile maybe. Wow. We all just came to a stark realization that the earth is going to reclaim every one of these cars. The amount of growth that has come up. These cars are done for. They're done. They're staying no here. Hope. They live here now. There's a 240 smash. Oh man. Some of these drifty dreams right there. Been sitting here 10, 15 years. What? <clears throat> ah. Purple. Yeah. Purple. Huh. Airbag went off. Yeah, definitely. Well, this is definitely some F and F '90s stuff right here, buddy. All the purple tail bits. The taillights are perfect. Yeah. Mez has uh, told us about um, some 240s, more all 240s. in a more 240s, all in a row, and we just want to go pay our respects. Yes. Guys, if you like this type of video, let us know. We've never done anything like this on the channel, but we've always kind of wanted to. So, you know, if you like it, let us know by liking the video, commenting, and telling us you like it so we can do more of it. We seem to have found the 240 graveyard to the drift cars that could have been that went to the junkyard prematurely before their time. Shout out to my boy James here for taking us. How's it going? Yeah, thanks, man. No Appreciate problem. it. I knew you would enjoy this. Check out the boat just chilling out in the middle of the woods. I wonder how they even got that there. Is that not one of the craziest spider webs you've ever seen? Another equally eerie room. Yeah, with a hospital bed. Hospital bed. Wakeboards. Wakeboards. And water skis. Water skis. Well, we did happen to find this license plate on this car on the way out, and lo and behold, it came here at least in 2016. So I'm guessing that this place was ran for many, many years, and it started in the back and they kind of worked their way forward to the newer stuff out here. There's no real rhyme or reason to anything, it's just kind of strewn about. We've made it 
made it back out to the front now, so we're going to sign off on this video. Thanks for checking it out. Again, please let us know what you think. We had an absolute great time making this, and a big shout out to my boy James, or as we all call him, Mez. Thanks again, my brother, for taking us out there, man. See you guys in the next video. Chronicle. Check this out.